Hello, my unlimited people. If you want to know how I prepare this delicious Nigeria vegetable stew, keep watching, guys. Let's get down to the video. Hello, my gorgeous people. Thank you so much for clicking this channel. I am Unlimited God's Favor. Welcome to Unlimited Anointed Gifts channel. If you are new to my channel, do not forget to hit that red subscribe button and turn on that bell notification whenever I upload a video. You will be among the first people to be notified. My returning subscribers, you guys are so amazing. Thank you so much for always checking back. God bless you all. As you can see, I'm boiling my chicken. I had some onions with uh, thyme. Dry pepper with curry powder, you know, with some seasoning. I'm using uh, organ seasoning. You can use any seasoning of your choice, guys. What I had, I just had a uh, fresh garlic. Okay, if you don't like garlic, just keep garlic and with ginger, fresh ginger powder with some salt. Stay it together. I like to cook. In this video, guys, we are making delicious Nigeria vegetable stew, guys. So yummy and delicious vegetable stew, okay? So as you can see, I just had some water into the cooking meat. Cover it and allow the meat to cook to your taste. I had uh, I had it, uh, dry pepper, you know. Fish. I have micro fish. Go to add it to the meat. Like to cook with the meat. Guys, please don't forget to hit the red subscribe button. I have my pepper here. I have fresh bonnet pepper. So I'm having an extra virgin olive oil, guys. You can use any oil of your choice, okay? But I'm using a strategic olive oil. So add the onions to the oil, stay it together, fry it for like three to four minutes. Guys, please subscribe if you haven't subscribed to my channel. What I have in there, I have a uh, blended tomatoes with a. Uh, bell pepper which is tatashi i've already cooked them for like 20 minutes i've parboiled them earlier okay i'll just add it to the oil and stay together guys have you liked this video have you give this video a thumbs up that is my uh, pepper i show you guys earlier okay i just add the pepper into the tomatoes mix stay together together let it cook that is my stock the stock from the chicken i cooked earlier okay give this video a thumbs up okay just add a chicken um, seasoning stay together i had any seasoning of your choice i had a curry powder Give this video a thumbs up, guys. Have you shared this video? Have you shared this video? <laughs> Share my video. <laughs> yeah, that is the meat it's inside the oven. I'll just allow that to marry the oven to roast a little bit, you know. <laughs> yeah, our tomato sauce is almost ready. Look at the stew. Yes, I just had um blended crayfish that I did by myself at home, guys. Check the video how I make my powder crayfish. Check the video, guys, okay? Let me see what you think because I need this few. That is the meat, the chicken I showed you guys earlier. It's time to add it to the sauce. Add it and stay together. But bring your plate to come and eat all your stew. <laughs> I just add salt to taste, you know? Had the fish. All right. For this recipe, I just use chicken and fish. That is what I'm craving for for this recipe, guys. And the stew comes so delicious. Wow! Bring your plate to 
our stew is ready. Can you to eat a uh, white rice, yam, whatever you fit to use it, with, okay? That is the spinach. I just have a frozen spinach. I froze the spinach myself, okay? So I'm using the spinach because this stew is vegetable stew, guys. Oh my goodness. This stew tastes so yummy, delicious. I bring your plate to thank you if you watch on for this time. God bless you guys for watching. I really appreciate you guys. I love you guys. My returning subscribers, take kiss. That is for you. You guys should bring plate to come and join me. Let's eat this stew together. Okay, I used to eat white yam. I used to eat rice. Even the uh, what is it called? Pasta, spaghetti. It looks so yummy. Thank you guys for watching. It's gonna come your way next time. Bye.